Raven. <laughs> One year later. Well, this is the end. We did it! Fun times Finally. were had. All the way to the end of the store. Mm -hmm. Oh, look! New digs. <sighs> At least Raven finally has a place to live. I mean, she's kind of crashy her hair every now and then, if not... Oh, yeah. Raven. Hey! Raven! <laughs> hey! Heading out to patrol the town? Oh, yeah. I was just getting ready to go now. Osha? Sid, did you ever figure out what happened to that kid who's king? We found him. He was still alive, so we had to take him into custody. How? How did that how did that little bastard survive? How is he still around and cat's not? It's just not fair! Oh, uh, you know. His guardian. I thought that guardian died too at uh, but <clears throat> He somehow managed to vanish on us. Gee, I wonder how. Kera. Hey, who would have thought the day would would have come when you'd become the town's hero? You come a long way from that Raven girl who stuck who struck fear into people's hearts. I mean, remember that time you held the entire like parts of Hexaville hostage within the Rift Plane? Yeah, good times. <laughs> good times. <laughs> Should have said it was for the children. But yeah, mm. for the kids. For the children. Anyway. Hmm. People change. Guess people change. <laughs> of course. That's what makes us human. I heard the Bonga fleet was coming today. Guess we're gonna dock at the town town pier. You should drop by. They'll be happy to see a familiar face. Du jour. Maybe I will. What about you, Sid? I'll pass the time. No, I'll pass this time. I have some stuff to take care of. I'm busy hunting down a hard-to-find wine. Yeah. <laughs> of course. Does this hard-to-find wine have to do with a black cat in the label? <laughs> Excellent guess, Raven. Tell East and the others I said hi! Oh, yeah. I will. And hope you find that wine. Yeah, you know what's funny? So we joke about how like we don't see any fucking like apple like or like any apple fields or like whatever. Where the fuck are they getting the grapes for the wine? Good Sorry. question. Later. Yeah, if there's no if there's barely any apple, I'll stop by at the factory today. I wonder. And if there's barely any yeah. apple orchards, where do they keep I knew I'd have that camera somehow. The, where do they keep the fucking vineyard or vineyards in Hexaville or anywhere really? Or any farm for that matter to grow livestock? Where do they keep those? Oh, uh, you know. Off screen. Gravity? Oh. <laughs> oh, right. <laughs> I've just been so used to that answer. It's been so long, but. Yeah. I still can't believe we're finally at the end. The end of our journey. The end of all things. And you know what? Honestly, I... Uh, fight! Someone stop them! <laughs> Guess I better break them up. I could stop World them, star! but... World star! World, World star! World star! World star! <laughs> 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 what? They're not even hitting each other, they're just punching the I air! Just, honestly, just like that. I'm gonna punch the air, and if you get hit, it's your fault! Oh yeah, well I'm gonna start swinging if you get close, this is gonna be your fault. Yeah. Okay, break it up. Enough world star for now. Yeah. Oh, what the? Okay, that's who's what that the does. real world star now. <laughs> that's done. Raven. It's Raven. Thank you for helping keep the peace. And what's with this whole world star stuff that you keep mentioning? Oh, um, don't mention it's just, um, online trend. Hmm, well, um, we just got approved to deploy more officers to Alt Noir. Okay. So you can leave this place to us. You can't spend the rest of your life fighting crime. I mean, you could, but 
I kind of want to do that. But anyway, you should go and have an idea out to yourself. Uh, Maybe drop by that fortune teller in Playtreat and ask if love is in the cards. So Boss, she's a big girl. Let her live. Not let her live her own life. Do you? <laughs> Sounds like my next stop is Plagian. Sui. Yes, of course. Uh. And after what happened, have you heard? Eva. Nothing. I see. Looks like Plagian's next on the patrol route. Oh, hey, more birds. Birds. Let's see. Oh, hey, I never knew that Chaz and Newt had the same voice actor. Hey. Hello. You can knock the fuck out! <laughs> God, I love that scene so much. Uh, the way Chris Tucker yeah. just fucking sounds like, You can knock the fuck out! Like, he said that like three different times in the movie, I'm, I'm pretty sure. I should but not yeah, I have to go through that movie to look for that scene. Since we're nearing the end of our journey, I just want to say it's been fun for both occasions that- Oh. Is that Aljin down there? You know, the- Oh, fuck! Damn it. <laughs> Stop. You Stop know- the fuck out. We- There's never been, like, any really interactions with Raven and, like, Cat's, like, friends, or- and, I stretched yeah, a friend for this guy. I know, like, we never really see Raven interacting with any of these other people. So, even though this is, like, the very end of the game, nice to see Raven interacting with some of the other friends Cat's made. Yeah, her even interacting though the term, with, like, even, Ajin, that ought to be interesting. Yeah. Uh, hey, honey. You'd be proud of Yuji. He's nothing, he's nothing like his old man. Yeah, I bet. Let's celebrate! Is your glass ready when you are? I mean, you are of legal drinking age, right? Right? <laughs> Aljean, I'm not, not having a drink with your wife. Oh, oh uh, Raven! Uh, I got big news! My boy Yuji made it to the Arcopus Academy! Oh. Congratulations! That's not easy. I mean, those ACT tests are no joke. Oh yeah, tell me about it. Those were a real bitch to handle when I was a kid. Uh, if Cat were around, her jaw would have hit the ground. I mean, I uh, doubt she would have made a good tutor and all. I mean, with uh, all those gems she'd been taking. Yeah, I'll bet it. I'll bet it would. Besides, I don't think she. I mean, as much as I respect Cat, I don't think she would make a good tutor either. But where is Yuji? I'd like to congratulate him in person. Ooh. He's already over at the school, scoop no, scoping it out. Nice. Okay, I'll head over there. <laughs> Make sure to tell Yuji to keep his nose in those books! Alright, let's go. Huh. I mean, I wouldn't know about those ACTs. I mean, uh, those are probably a new thing since, I, after all, I I didn't really finish elementary school when I was a kid. But yeah, okay, it's true. Say. Raven didn't really finish elementary school. She kind of just like, oh wow, it's Raven! It's Raven, Raven, I'm your biggest fan. <laughs> nice. <laughs> I dropped that dude <laughs> straight from the gate over there. Where is Yuji? Ah, oh, great. Whoop. You know what I wish would happen in Gravity Rush 3? Mm. Raven having her own gravity styles. Yeah, that'd be cool. But anyway... You know what? The gravity styles would be cool if they were, like, weather-related. <gasps> oh yeah, that would be also cool. Look at these nerds. <laughs> oh, hey, Raven. Out on patrol. Oh. Yep, as always. I heard your dad got you. I heard from your dad that you got into the academy. I figured you were all ready to take over his ice cream stand. Huh. Nah, my friend set me straight. Got me to see studying was important. School's supposed to open your eyes and expand your horizons. 
sound like that. <laughs> yeah, uh, it's a shame I never got to complete my elementary school education. But not after that whole field trip and all, and I got... And I climbed up 50 years late. What? It's a long story. Do you even remember it? Uh... Man. Well, um, I, I said, long story. I anyway, like, you? I always figured school would be boring, but I guess it's not all bad. Oh. I'll keep that in mind. Maybe you might go back one day and actually get a college education. Who knows? My grandpa was the one who first turned me on to school. Once I'm done studying here, I'm gonna head out to see the world. Me, I'm gonna study hard and become president of my own ice cream company. People will be falling all over themselves with my premium wares. I'm gonna make Pops proud. Just don't tell him I said that. Do ya? Good luck, and it'll be our little secret. I'll keep my lips are sealed. Don't worry. Next is time to drop on the Naki. But yeah, for real. Even though this is the end of our journey, I really enjoyed the, like, the time that we had. It's oh, been yeah. fun. Like, to actually been part of something bigger than myself. The part of the Gravity Rush community. Even though as small as our videos might be, any of, it's still fun to make them regardless. <laughs> Pandora welcomes you, Raven! Oh god, what, what's wrong with her voice? Oh yeah. But, oh, uh, I'm, uh, I'm here for my fortune. Oh. Anytime. I'm guessing you want the usual. Pandora, tell us the future. Today's lucky spot is downtown. Pandora, Raven wants to know about the one she's waiting for. Today's lucky spot is downtown. Today's lucky spot is. Hmm. My Pandora's not feeling well. Well, I mean, I doubt she's ever well with that weird voice of hers. But, um, well, it's hard to ignore her advice, but I'll try my luck downtown. I'm sorry. You don't have to pay before me today. <laughs> not charging me? Now I think you're the one that's not feeling well. <laughs> May peace and joy be with you, Raven. And you're not the only one who's waiting. Yeah, waiting to get her own 3D model. Might as well drop by Industria it's on the, since it's on the way. Yeah, that is the most craziest thing is that she does not have a 3D model. Yeah, not even the first game. Like, all we see of Aki is just like her 2D drawing inside of her building. Maybe, yeah. uh, maybe Infinite Titami can make a 3D model for her. I was saying the same thing, but somebody would have to commission that. <laughs> Nothing out of the ordinary here. Not yet. <laughs> but yeah, it's weird how Cat didn't really have a weird reaction to, like, a stronger reaction to Sid wearing Alias's outfit since they're basically one and the same. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Oh, got incoming! Oh yeah, they're changing up the place around here. Oh, right. Oh. Unica! Permit! You're alive! <laughs> everyone pulled through. Well, almost everyone. Oh, sure. What are you going to do now? We stopped the invasion from the top of the world. Hexville doesn't need the Jellyfish Special Forces anymore. Nevertheless, we'll continue to train. We need to be ready if there's ever another threat. See, Wasp. Commander Yuri is calling us back. Right. Come on, Sea Slug! Roger that. Super fighting robot away! Let's roll! And rock. Okay, 
Time to take Pandora's advice and go downtown. <sighs> I'm really gonna miss this place, you know? Oh, yeah. I'm really gonna miss flying around Hexaville, collecting gems, talking about the weirdest things that... Uh, and all the VTuber talk fun. you like to bring up. And me, okay, and with you. And, for and Warhammer 40,000 lore. Oh, yeah. That's fun. Everything's fine Everything's here. fine here. All right. Uh, I, that's yep. Raven's lines. I am, like... I, you're just, like, take us... There's a lot of lines for you, because you're voting a lot of characters that I just, like... When that black box comes up, I have to keep reminding myself not to speak. Yep, for the time being, I'm taking over protagonist duties. <laughs> Unlike in the DLC. Oh, yeah. All the way back. Huh? There we go. Is that Newton Echo over there? <laughs> oh! Woo! Nice. Air time! That was a complete accident. Wait. Ah, damn it, I forgot to take a picture. That, that was, an, that was an actual G up there. Yeah. That's a real G on the, bo on the board. Get it? Mm. <laughs> Stop it. I just got her to sleep. <laughs> Dude! Echo! A long time no see! Raven! Hey! You haven't seen the kid yet! This is our daughter. Oh, she's adorable! What's her name? Alwa. That's the name the for uh, teller over at Pandora's Fortunes gave us. <laughs> the name comes from the word Alpha, meaning the beginning of everything. We fell in love with the name the moment we heard it. Aula, huh? I like it. It's cute. <laughs> it seems so unreal that we can be together like this. You saved us. Thank you, Raven. And Cat. And Lisa, too. She's doing a great job leading Hexaville. Oh, well, nice to know that Hexaville's actually in good hands now. No corrupt governments to actually lead it astray this time. Nope. She pulled us and Jira Parallel out together when we needed it. We're hoping she gets elected as mayor. Nice. Uh, oh, yeah. I'll let her know you said that. Salut. I hope I run into you. Uh, no. You three, again. Hmm? Hmm? Fleet ship. Hey, isn't that one of the Bonga airboats? Airboat. Same difference. It bum, is bum. indeed. Alright. Maybe I should head over and say hello. Click. <laughs> Okay, fly up there and let's get over. Alright. Yeah. Hey, Raven! Oh, nice to see Cece still alive. Oh, of course. Click. <laughs> Cecilia. I heard from Sid that the Bonga fleet was coming. I didn't know you'd be coming with it. Oh. Yeah, I've been so busy. Lisa's run you to. Lisa has to run two cities. She's swamped. Oh, sure. The people of Hexville think you're doing a great job. Any plans to run for mayor? I don't care much for titles. I just want to do what needs to be done, done. Lisa. Raven, you're both doing so amazing. It's amazing. It. Cece, you're doing an amazing job yourself. Go on, told me you were handling everything well. You're the only reason I can stay away from Bunga as long as I do. Lajule. Guess you're really growing into your new role, Cece. I always wanted to be strong and positive. <laughs> like Cat.
Speaking of Guan, are, are he and Misai still around? Yeah, they're helping out with some of the traders on the other airboats. Vogo and the others are here too. Look. Oh, come on! What's this doing here? What are you getting worked up about now? It's kind of funny just seeing like she just flying around like this. Like Dusty is just right. always just like just standing around or walking, but then she here is just like whoopity whoopity. I'm a bird. Look at me. I'm an asshole bird. <laughs> and, yeah, I mean it's kind of weird to let you have the power to shift gravity when your when your guardian partner can already fly on its own. Oh, yeah. Anyway. How is the rising sun going? How's he doing? Hold on, hold on. I have a stupid thing for this. I just, got, I just want to wait for the animation. But then, I found out it was a horse! <laughs> it's like a really, really old thing from a <laughs> specific webcomic. Hey, Raven! How's life? Oh. Good. And you haven't changed a bit. Uh, well, you know me. The rising sun, like me, ages like a fine wine. <laughs> what? We're doing great. You, you can always rely on the brothers of sun shipping. We take our business seriously. See, Avi. Yes, we do, Vogo. Hmm. Well, Vogo, maybe you have changed. Avi. We need to get this cargo delivered on the double. That what? That's the one bound for the ship Guan San. Oh. Oh yeah. Leave it to me. I was going to see Guan anyway. Really? <laughs> oh, that helped us out a bunch. Guan's over on an air uh, airboat docked at the small shipping pier. Say, hey, Raven, you still all by yourself? Seeing anyone? You must miss her. You were always together. Like, um... The couple of besties, if you know what I mean. Alright, I think that's enough. It feels so quiet about her. Around. You just have to accept the changes life brings and move forward. Uh, yeah, exactly. Thank you for your help with the cargo. I'm going to talk to you about this later. Uh, what I do? Uh, thanks for your help, by the way. All right. What? But yeah, what I do, Fee? What I do? I am going to give you a lecture later. Just be prepared for that. For now, oh. we have work to do. Oh, great. Time for this sun to set. Bye, everyone. Goodbye, everyone. Oh, yeah. Ah, Raven, is that you? It's been so long. Oh, sir. Looking for this? I brought it from Vogo. Yes! Yes, I was! Thank you! When I thought- when I saw it was missing, I thought I might have miscounted. Growing old, you can't depend on your memory like you used to. Oh, I still remember a lot of things from when I was younger. You know, sometimes I, I mistake Cece for a young Lisa. Bunny! Isn't it, Cat? No, go. Raven. Oh, uh, right. Sorry. Just step there for a second. De la femme. It's okay. Just take care of yourself, go on. I will. You're a kind girl. Strong, too. But if you ever need to talk, come, no, come on by Banga Settlement anytime you want. Oh. I will. Thank you, Guan. Hey, Raven! Misai? I haven't heard you in ages. Man, I can or jump so high 
and she won't have any fall damage like Cat. <laughs> Nice ride. It'd be a shame if it were to explode. Oh yeah, those vehicles aren't safe. <laughs> hey, looking good, Raven. Been so long. Was wondering what you've been up to. Oh. Sorry, I've just been so busy with patrols. Oh. Admit it. You were just worried you might stir up some old memories for us. Lies. You got me. You can't fool me, but you don't have to hide. You never know, she might be out there, somewhere. Huh? You really believe that? I've accepted it. I keep her memory with me, but I've moved on. Hey, I just said you can't fool me. You don't have to put on a brave face. What do you know about what it's like to have half of who you are torn away from you? Oh, I'm sorry. I shouldn't have said that. La Sebi. I just have to believe she's out there somewhere, happy, living the life to the fullest. Ah, shoot. Now you've got me tearing up. Just stop by Bonga more often, okay? Oh, yeah. Uh, thank you. I will. And thank you for worrying about me. That's what I'm here for. What? Oh, is that? What's that? Oh, oh, nothing. No one's here. But that voice sounded like. Get back from there! It's dangerous, and we need to go. A cat? Geronimo! How much fall damage? Not a damn one. None. Am I imagining things? What the? There it is again! It's coming from over there! Uh, what? Okay, come on. Where are you? You gotta be over here. Jude, no, 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 Oh, that was a beautiful shot right there. Damn. What a ride. What a fucking ride that was. Oh, yeah. So here's a, here's a fun thing that's pretty obvious by now, but for every thumbnail that I've made for part two of Gravity Rush, in part one, I just went like the super, oh hey, that photo's there. Oh, it is oh. all my photos. Huh, nice. Oh, they're your photos, neat. <laughs> hey, it's that one, nice. Anyway, uh, as you know, you know, first game, it was just me by myself, and like, you know, until like, up to 95% of it, or 90%. Yeah, the, but, 90, uh, up to 95% was, which was when I joined it. Yeah, and, you know, it's just been like, generic thumbnail and like the same exact intro, cause like, you know, I was doing this for fun to see if I could, like, just with the poor man's recording, which is my cell phone, and for audio commentary, as I mentioned a couple times here and there, and then, you know, PS4 recording. So, when, I, you know, when it was still locked down last year, I had a lot more free time. Oh, hey, it's Obama. <laughs> That's still funny. Nice to see Obama still canon in Gravity Rush. Oh, he sure is. Here's a close-up shot. <laughs> so, so because I had all that free time last year, up till like early this year, I figure, hey, let me see what I can do since I have all this free time and see about making these thumbnails and these outros, or intros and outros, a lot more special. And of course, you know, the outro changed a little bit here and there from like switching from a cat being held at gunpoint at the end to just her singing. But also, when I was making the thumbnails, 
it's so, it sometimes became hard to pick what images to pick. But one thing I wanted to do that was really important was add these little photos onto them. And so, you know... Yeah, just to make them a bit more special. Because I knew, you know, at the very end, at the final uh, credits and roll credits of the game, there would be a slideshow credits with all of these photos that you've taken throughout the game. And I thought, I might as well, like, add them to uh, the thumbnails. That might be fun. And, you know, yeah. that, that was pretty simple. Making the thumbnails, that could be... That's kind of hard sometimes, especially most recently when it came to uh, the Durga the Angel one. one. Oh, right. You know, when I sent you those pictures trying to figure out which ones to use because, oh, those are some good screenshots. I had to go frame by frame to pick specific ones. And then the intros, that just made it hard for me, especially now that I'm working and I have to find the free <laughs> time to do this. Yeah, and it's also for me, with like university and also my job and all, like having it hard, and also the fact that my dorm's Wi-Fi is absolute shit, but, I, but times like this where I have breaks actually gives me enough time to actually join in and record and all. Yeah. And for the times that we do, and even though I have stuff going on which kind of prevents me from recording my own outros, oh yeah, I still have fun doing so. Like, I... Like, like I said before, it's nice to actually be a part of the Gravity Rush community in some way. And no matter how small it is, like, actually contributing it to some way. Yeah, I like making those, like, couple of simple, basic-ass, basic, basic quote-unquote, photoshops that I made off of my phone. Like, the one with Mo, where he's holding up two knives, but it's just two cats, one in Lunar Style and one in Gravity Style. But I think my favorite one was the last one I did. Which was of Cat, <laughs> Cat, her head, talking. her head on the MC from the Protector in that one scene. Oh, the Protector. Yeah, yeah, yeah. man. Uh, I was talking to a coworker like about uh, when I mentioned the name, and I showed him that meme, and he chuckled a little bit. But apparently, he had seen all those movies and like the Ong Bak film too. And I was like, I don't remember which Ong Bak it was that I saw, but I liked it. So I gotta check that out sometime. But yeah, here we are, the very end. So all I can ask is this, what's next? Well, where do we go from here? I do have an idea. If, uh, if, so like, recording with you is kind of easier because, well, quote unquote easier. It'd be, it would be physically easier to like record with my friend because I do have an idea for I, I've already I said it like once or twice here and there for like doing Katamari Damashi because Katamari Damashi with my homie would be pretty cool he's not a fan of it I'm not a fan of it but we both roll with that shit and we love the music and it is a pretty fun game but it'd be tricky trying to record because uh, well he'd have to come over to my place which is just, it's not that far, but then there's also, you know, time constraints, like of us. And ideally, yeah, exactly. ideally, it would be great to do it at his place, because he's got a big old fucking house. Like, he's got a huge-ass house in the neighborhood, cul-de-sac, all that good shit. However, he does have some loud dogs. I'm lucky that my dog doesn't bark all the time, and, like, ever so rarely during these recordings and anytime she does it's like usually when I'm not talking so that's hilarious and I can just edit that out but like yeah it would be hard to do that at his place it might be easier to do it at my place but I'll have to figure that out way later because I have something in mind for the next game for now we're gonna take a break, mainly just for me to just screw around, have fun, and catch up on some anime, but, like One Piece. Oh, hey, look, it's the final picture! Look, and thank you so much, Keichiro Toriyama, for this amazing series. I can only hope for what you might bring us next. But, as for what will be next for you and me, will be a co-op game. And Co-op? Yes. 
da, 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 da. Hey, Apple. Neat. Yeah. Story complete. Congratulations on clearing all the main story missions. You can continue to explore the world even after you're done. You'll be sent back to the er, you'll be sent back to Hexaville before climbing the world pillar, but you will retain all your powers you've earned after. You can climb the world pillar again or complete any unfinished side or challenge missions or continue mining for ore. So, here's the thing is uh I thought about, you know, like this would have been harder for me because then like the videos would have been delayed but i was considering for a second since we did record that other half earlier that should be up by now uh like because i already finished like half the editing at least for that for the first half of uh, this final end of the game but i was thinking we would stretch it out a little bit by going to those mines and finding those rare green nevi i kind of did on the side accidentally to like just get some more gems and uh, I found a green one by accident, like the the basic Nebby, and killed it. It was a lot more easier oh. than I thought it was. Well, okay, oh. not really. It was it it was more simple than I thought it'd be because if at actually instead of like the other original green Nebby from the first game, this one just floated around and just fucking shot at me Toho style. <laughs> so I had to move around and find my kicks in. But yeah, as for what the next thing we might do, I'll just leave that as a surprise, and I'll have it at the end card. Because I haven't even shown you the commissioned art I have for um, Tony Weld, but that'll be a fun surprise, so I still won't tell you. Ooh, okay, yeah, yeah I'll, I'll wait for whenever this happens. But I've, but since we're at the end here, all I can say is thank you so much, Icy, for having me aboard and for this amazing and odd journey of ours of de of snorting up lines of gems, talking about weird shit, and just ki manipulating gravity to your will. And sending people into the abyss. All those innocent fun people. Fun times. Oh, yeah. But, yeah, it's been fun, but, no, but sadly, some stories have done to a close, so to those who have joined us on this journey, thank you for watching. I hope you have a great day. And again, I can't be any happier to I can't be any more happy to join this journey and have been a part of it. But for now, ah, damn it. later everyone. Thanks goodbye. for wasting your time with us. And catch you around in the next game. Woo! Woo! Bye bye. Later. Bye. Get out of here. Raven catches up with friends on patrol as the town's guardian sends Kat's disappearance. And following up on Pandora's fortune telling, meets with the one she's been waiting for. Thank you all again for joining us on this, from the janky beginnings to the final end of this LP. Whatever is next, I hope you join us there too. Until then, see you later. Sí, sí, sí.